Now? Really? Hello, my YouTube friends. Did you ever struggle to get high quality audio from Discord when you're streaming or recording? Well, you're not alone. Many people face this issue and it can be super frustrating. I'm going to walk you through the easiest way to capture Discord audio in OBS. So you're going to sound like a pro in no time. So you know what? Let's get to it! Your Twitch or YouTube channel is a representation of you. And that's why I've been critical of people using in-game chat audio in their live streams. You have absolutely no control over what could be said in that chat or who could be saying it. Now, I personally don't think it's smart to put your channel and your reputation in jeopardy for people you may not even know. And that's why I recommend using Discord for capturing in-game chat. Does it make it more complicated to build a squad in some games? Sure, but that's a small price to pay for the health of your channel and your reputation. So make the effort and use Discord or something like it to capture in-game chat. It's just not worth the risk. So with that said, let me show you how to capture that Discord audio. Okay, so I'm going to show you two different ways that you can capture your audio from Discord. And the first way, we're going to go ahead and click the plus here. And we're going to go to a audio output capture. We can just call this Discord or it's actually better described as desktop because this is all of your desktop audio. So anything that you would hear in the primary audio source. So if we go down here and we see what our primary audio source is, when you're live streaming, it's going to be your headphones. You're going to be listening to your headphones and that audio from wherever the game and everything else can't go back into your microphone. So you have to have headphones on in order to keep that from happening. So then we're going to just drop this down and we're going to select those headphones. So now anything that's being broadcast to your headphones is also going to be broadcast to your audio. Now this can pose some problems because obviously we also have the game audio that's playing in our headphones. So we're capturing that. You don't want to be capturing your game audio in here and then also capture your desktop audio in here because that will cause audio doubling. Um, so if you already have your game audio captured in here and you're broadcasting it, Capturing your desktop audio is probably not the best solution. So let's say that you already have your game audio captured. Well, we don't want to use desktop audio. What we're going to do is go ahead and click the plus here and we're going to go to application audio capture and we can just call this discord and click OK. And then all we need to do is go in here, drop this down and find our discord. So right here we see Discord, we can just click OK. And now we can see right here, we have no audio coming in from Discord and that's because we are not in any chat rooms. If we go over here, you can see we're just in the thing. If we went down here into a chat room, we had other guests, we would be able to hear that right here. So that's really the long and short of capturing it. If you don't want to capture your game audio and you just want your game audio and your chat audio in the same thing, then just use a desktop capture. If not, then use the specific Discord audio capture by going into application audio capture. It's really that simple. And if you are running into an echoing problem, well, you just want to look into whether you're capturing desktop audio and you already have game audio in here because, well, that's going to cause problems. It's pretty simple, no matter which method you choose. Did I leave something out though? Well, let me know about it down in the comments. And if you're struggling with audio issues like echo, well, check this video out. And if you're always looking for tools, tips, and tricks to help make you a better live streamer or YouTuber, subscribe to the channel. My name is Michael Fire Jr. Thank you so much for watching. Have a great day. And I'll see you in the next one.